Um, What's we're that? Gone. We're gone. If you guys didn't okay. know, Aspen just released a pop socket. Wait, we gotta show them. Check them out. I'll show some close-ups and have Parker put them in there with the magic of editing. But basically, today's vlog, we thought it would be fun. We're not centered though. We gotta like scoot a little bit. We thought it would be fun to start a little mini kind of like story time series. But the story is going to be like our story. So we're gonna start off with how we met and like how we started dating and everything. You guys will kind of hear from like my side and Parker's side. And then we can do like the story of our first kiss and whatever else you guys want to see so there's not gonna be like that many parts to this series but I thought it would be fun because whenever I find like a new couple on YouTube or like anywhere that's one of the first things I search is like if they posted how they met or how they got engaged or all of that stuff so I thought it'd be fun for... I'm gonna sit on a pillow so I look taller so you look you. taller okay there wow so I thought it would be fun for us to do that but before we do that I'm super excited because my pop sockets collection is out so I have four pop sockets and they're so freaking cute and I'm so excited we're gonna put the link down below if you guys want to get them I'll just do this actually this is what they look like the cactus one's upside down but i think the cactus one right here is my favorite but i also really like this one because it has my favorite colors in it so yeah i'm super excited i took my phone case off but i'm gonna put one on my phone do you want to start okay what am i what am i telling the story of just like we're just talking about how we met each other first time i met aspen she doesn't remember i don't i guess I mean, I'm sure she really does remember. I don't. Why would she I knew lie? who I was like I knew in like name. sixth grade. You did? Wait. Uh, I'd like heard the name Parker Ferris, but I didn't know you. That young? No. Okay. I don't know. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'd never heard your name until really? like freshman year. I'm not popular. <laughs> That's okay. Well, it's weird though because of like the friends that you've hung out with and like I like hung out with them a lot. Sometimes too, you know, but it's weird. Whatever. Point is, I was not popular. We went to the same elementary school in fourth grade. Yeah, but we, we didn't, didn't know. know each other. Anyways, first the story of the first time I ever hung out with you, we were at, I guess it was like a little party. It was it was just like a bunch of friends hanging out. It was, it was at my neighbor's, neighbor's house. house. Yeah. And she was there and that was like- You asked did. me about YouTube? I didn't ask you, oh. but everyone else was. I remember being at Brandon's house and a YouTuber girl being like talked to or like asked questions about being a YouTuber. <laughs> oh, I don't remember. I, don't... I remember like the, the party. It was just like friends hanging out, but yeah. I don't remember like talking to Parker or you being there. I don't- I didn't year? talk to you. I was hanging out on the cool side of the room. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, so that's the first time apparently. Yeah, I don't remember like what the first time we hung out was. So Parker was always friends with the guys that went to my school. And then since they went to my school, I was friends with those guys too. So that's like Ruger, um, you guys know my friend Evan, Jordan, Austin. Um, so like I was friends with all those guys and then Parker was friends with all those guys, but he went to a different school. So you started hanging out with I, them. I was friends with all those guys. And I then was you too. were friends with all those guys. No, me and Jordan had sixth grade math together. I was in Jordan's fourth grade class. <laughs> That's not the point. I was friends with them too though. So then did you hang out with them a lot before sophomore year? I feel like you started hanging out with them more like the end of sophomore year and that's when No, like... I hung out with them a lot freshman year too. Oh, I don't know. So then all of a sudden Aspen became cool and popular. <laughs> Not what happened. Oh. What it was happened? like my friends started, like my girlfriends and like those guy friends, like we kind of started hanging out. Yeah, that's right. So like I was friends with Ruger and like we would all hang out with Ruger and then Parker was friends with all those guys too. So then he would come hang out. So that's how I met was just through like our mutual friends. Yep. And it was like the end of our sophomore year. But then it was in the summer and we started hanging out like a lot and Ruger used to live right by me. So it was like me, Parker, and Ruger were like the three musketeers and we would always hang out with each other. And then Parker just fell in love with me. Okay, so what happened was, it was like me, Ruger, and Aspen that would always hang out. What would we do? We would hang out and watch Workaholics. And she That's would tickle my show. back and I would tickle her back. And she would tickle. From the no. beginning I told Ruger, I was like, hey dude, I think I really like this one. You can't do anything, all right? And he's like, all right. It's fine. But I remember since I did live farther away, I had a 12 o'clock curfew and I had to like drive farther. So I had to leave earlier and Aspen would stay at Ruger's. And I remember one time I texted uh, Ruger. I think it was because like, I don't even know. You just stayed there and I texted Ruger. And I was like, hey dude, like something about, you know, I'm trying to go for Aspen or something. <laughs> and Aspen had Ruger's phone. And yeah. read it. My curfew was 12.30 and Ruger lived right by me. So like Parker would go home and me and Ruger would sit outside on the grass and just like talk or whatever for like 30 minutes. And yeah, I had Ruger's phone and then I saw it and then... And then yeah. she realized that she had the same feelings for me. No, that's not, yeah. that's not true. I think I knew you like kind of had a crush on me, but I don't really remember. No, you did This didn't. was like 
five, six years ago. Yeah, that's It was weird. like five years ago, five years ago. Like yeah, exactly weird. five it years ago. It feels like just yesterday. It also feels like five years ago. So then it was like all summer we hung out and then we went back to school. Parker went to a different school and he was on the football team and I cheered so we were both like super super busy So like all the friends didn't hang out as much because it wasn't summer, you know, unless it was yep. like the weekends But Parker would come over to my house like every single night and we would sit outside on the back of his truck And just like talk mm -hmm. and hang out. I don't know why we didn't go inside I never liked having friends over at my house or like people inside But it was just fun to sit outside and like hang out and the weather was nice because it's like still summery weather Those were the times. And it was fun. And then we kissed. If you Hey, that's a story hold on. for a different day. I got an, I got a, I got something. An Aspen song in that song that oh, yeah. Alex wrote. In there it says something. I'll put the lyric. I'll I'll play the song, but it says something about like the starry nights or something. And that was inspired by us sitting on our on my tailgate at night. Like those starry nights, yeah. Yep. And then I think it says like we should know. <laughs> I know yeah. the words, but like right now I'm like uh, I think it says something about like you and me and nights in your car or something. Yep, it says something like that. And something like that. The starry nights and yeah, uh, in my the back of my truck or okay. I don't even know. Never knew it'd be nights alone in my car, just me, you, the stars and moon. It wasn't anything crazy in the back. It was like to <laughs> say on the tailgate, but yeah. And it was literally right in front of Aspen's house. So yeah, so we would do that, and then we kissed. So that'll be a different story. Yeah. So then it was junior year, and I just really didn't want like a boyfriend. Parker just wanted me so much, so I was just like, no. No. <laughs> just kidding. No. I still loved you, but like I just like I don't want a I boyfriend. Was, yeah. I had only kissed like. No, from the beginning, she boys. told me she was like. Yeah, from the beginning. Nothing's ever gonna happen between us. She's like, yeah. I'm gonna as soon as. I graduate, I am moving straight to LA. Did I say that at the beginning? You said that, that at the beginning. That was two years before you said, I even I've got. Know. You said, I've got bigger dreams out in LA. No, now. I did not freaking say I'm that. I'm going to be in, sh in show business. I, I did not say that. Movies. I don't think that was my plan to even move then. But no, I no, told him from the beginning. I was like, I don't want a boyfriend. I think I had only kissed like two people. I just wanted to kiss people, okay? We would like kiss, but then we would also kiss other people. But then I kiss more people than you. That she knows of. I kissed it. You did not that kiss that many. Of. So yeah, we were like a thing. We weren't exclusive at all. But Parker just like wanted me so bad. And then I just knew. And like when I think about this, I really do feel like sad. Like right now I'm like laughing. And I'm like, oh, ha, ha. But like when I really think about it, I could sit and cry. Because I feel like I was so mean. <laughs> just because like Parker really wanted me. And so I would just like... <laughs> You did, babe! I love how you keep throwing out. <laughs> Just cause like Parker really wanted me. Like, he did. <laughs> babe, you loved me, okay? Okay. But the camera died. Do you remember what you were talking about? I was saying how you wanted me and I didn't want you back. So anyways, Parker did want me more than I wanted him. You did. Okay. So I kind of would just, just like to keep point. him around, which is sad and not nice. And if you're in high school, don't do that to someone. Except sometimes it works out and you get married. <laughs> but... You make it sound like it was a bad thing for me. Like it wasn't bad because I had this girl that I could go to whenever I wanted to, to kiss her. And I could kiss any other girl I wanted. Like it wasn't yeah, bad. Yeah, but there me. were just like times that like, I mean, it was so long ago. I feel like neither of us kind of like really think about it or remember it. But like there were times when I was just like, I just should have been nicer about stuff. Like I just wasn't very nice. I was like mean. So okay. that's just like, I'm just saying, don't do that. That's mean. Okay. Just be nice. Yeah. So that was pretty much all of junior year. We that's did the that. story of how we met. We got to go all the way up until like, okay, I guess we'll just leave it on a cliffhanger. Yeah, exactly. That's the story of how we met. Comment down below if you guys want to see the first kiss. We were like vlogging a lot when we got engaged. Age, but still I feel, feel like it's good to have like like different parts of a series So if anybody's looking they can just type that in and it pops right up. So, now we're married. Now we are I should have worn my matching shirt. Parker wears this like a lot and he it's wears this hubby really shirt It's a really comfy shirt. It's really comfy. I'm wearing a black dress. It's from our store. It has pockets. It has pockets? Yeah, pockets make everything better. And a pop socket. And a pop socket. I'm gonna go put that one on my phone. So anyways, this vlog is gonna go up Monday and then we have a vlog we filmed like a couple days ago going up Wednesday and then don't know if we have one more vlog filmed or if that's gonna be like our Europe vlog or my Europe vlog that goes up on Friday. But we wanted to film this because we're just trying to make sure we can get a video up even though I'm gonna be traveling. Cause I leave tomorrow on Monday when you guys are seeing this. But Parker's staying here. I'm gonna be home. I got a bachelor pad for 10 days. So. I need to get a smaller curling iron before I leave because this one that I use just makes my hair Before you out. leave, you leave tomorrow yeah. morning. I don't know, maybe I'll, I'll tell my mom to bring hers. We'll see you guys in the next vlog. Bye, Bye guys. guys.